promise, what I'm about to do this week is feature some artists that I think you all should have in your music collection. Um, I just think they're incredible artists, and I would be doing you a disservice if I didn't introduce you to them. But today, the two artists that I'm going to introduce you to are not strangers to you at all. Um, they've both been featured on KakeySpeaks.com for different reasons. And to start with, we have the lovely Promise. Hey, guys. Who is not only one of my favorite artists, but honestly one of my friends. Oh, so Kiki. I'm really excited <laughs> to have her here. Um, so let's just get right to it. Promise yeah. is a... Uh, Multi-talented. She is a singer, songwriter, actress, dancer. What? Uh, Am I missing philanthropist, anything? Philanthropist, psychologist, psychologist. guidance counselor, <laughs> all that. She really is. A personal <laughs> train on the side, whatever you need. <laughs> That's Promisha, by the way. That just came out <laughs> for five seconds. <laughs> okay. So, Promise, please tell us what you've been doing. The last time we featured you, you were doing a photo shoot. Yes. Um, you guys remember the little Dorothy thing, like with the red slippers? That was super hot. Thank so you. So, what have you been up to since then? Um, so, since that photo shoot, um, the pictures, you can now see those online and everything. Mm -hmm. um, I had the pleasure of going on tour. I was working on the How Sweet the Sound tour. Wow. So, that was just a great experience. Very life-changing. Mm -hmm. um, since I've been back, I've been, you know, back in the studio working on more music and stuff. But I'm now finally releasing some of this music that I've been holding on to. Um, I've got a couple different projects going on, and I'm actually currently working on a movie. So, so a lot of stuff um, coming up for this year, and also for you know 2012. So, she stays busy, okay? And I'm not just saying that because she's sitting here. She really, really, truly is one of the hardest working artists that I know Thank you. personally, um, and that's just period. Now you do sing. You act, as we said, you know, you dance, you do a lot. How exactly do you manage to do it all and stay grounded and stay motivated um, with everything? Um, well, I mean, fortunately for me, I love all of it. Mm -hmm. Like, I, I mean, That's even cool. as a little girl, like, I love singing. I love dancing. I love, you know, so it's not that this is work for me. Like, this is, it's fun time. I get to go and just do what I love every day. Mm -hmm. um, but... I guess, you know, it's just about keeping a strong foundation of people around you, people that are just going to keep you humble, keep you focused, because it's very easy to get distracted or get caught up in just everything. Um, and, and just, you know, just staying true to what it is that you love. Um, mm -hmm. that's, that's, that's it. You know, I, I feel like it's a pleasure for me every day to get to do this. So Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. That is very important. Now, stemming from... You know, what keeps you grounded and, and motivated? Would you give that same advice to artists yeah, or, you know, sure. musicians <clears throat> who frequent KakeSpeaks.com and who are trying to do the same things that you have, you know, I would say been successful at doing for a while. I mean, there are levels of success. Yeah. I know that's what she's thinking. <laughs> but, you know, at this level, like where you are right yeah. now, how long have you been singing and performing? Yeah. Oh, how long? Yeah. I mean, I grew up doing it, but I mean, I've really been pursuing this for ten years. Yeah, I mean, so. like, this is not a oh, it's never an overnight thing, right? So, um, I guess the best advice I could give is don't expect, uh, don't expect results overnight. Mm -hmm. If that's what you're in it for, if you're in it for the wrong reasons, you will quickly be discarded. Mm -hmm. If it's just to get famous, just to get even money or whatever, it's like. You're gonna be broke for a long, long time before you really get to see, you know, uh, see the rewards. Um, but if your intentions are pure, if you really are just humble and really love it, just keep doing it, and and you know the blessings will come. Absolutely, absolutely. Now, um, talking about Promises Music, she actually recently released the project. Yep. It is called the, the Pinky, Pinky Project. Project. <laughs> it's so cute. <laughs> um, 
So can you please tell us a little bit about this project? Um, what was your inspiration behind it? And things like that. Pinky Project. It was literally, uh, I was brainstorming. Mm -hmm. um, I went through a period of just like, you know, every artist, it's like, how can I conquer the world? How can I, you <laughs> can know, I it, how can I really take over? Absolutely. And so I, I went through my little pinky in the brain phase of mm -hmm. just like taking over the world. And um, I felt like what is really lacking or what is really missing is just that timeless music. Mm -hmm. Music that isn't caught up in the trends or isn't, you know, where it's just good music. Like right. you can't get right. past how it makes you feel or whatever. So this um this is just a really classic sound. It takes you kind of back to the Idlewild era. Absolutely. Um, very jazzy, very soulful, but fun records. Um and so yeah, it's a it's one of many little EPs that I'm gonna release. Just so you yeah. guys can start to get a, a taste of my writing, a taste of my artistry, mm -hmm. um, and just, you know, get to know me a little bit better. So Great. Well, we're going to take a second right now to listen to, which record are we going to play then? Let's play Dainty. Okay. This is Dainty by Promise. <laughs>
Hey, we're back. I hope you all, I know you all enjoyed Dainty. Mm -hmm. Definitely one of my favorite records from Promise. Pinky's up. <laughs> I used to see background with Promise. I don't know if yeah. a lot of you know that. Oh. Um, then she got too big time for me and, you know, she became Cakey Speaks. Really? That time really? But really? But it's, it's all good. Really? It's all good. <laughs> really? <laughs> That's not true. Okay. It's all good. I still love you, girl. <laughs> Shot. Fired.com. Okay. <laughs> no. <laughs> but um, Daisy's always been one of my favorite songs to listen to and to sing. So yeah. it's just a fun record. It's it's about, um, again, like going back to, you know, the classic, you know, just music that's just classic. Mm -hmm. So I wanted to go back to a time when, you know, ladies were ladies, mm -hmm. men were gentlemen, um, and, you know, ladies, so pinkies up, you know. Um, <laughs> So it's just a fun record. It is. It is a. It is a very fun record. Um. Now we were talking about your music. Mm -hmm. We touched on the movie a little bit, but can you kind of tell us a little bit? I know when you're in, you know, when you're in the big time and you're doing like big screen movies, you know, because Promise would never just do a small <laughs> thing, you know, a small budgeted movie for her first movie because that's just not how Promise does anything. Uh -huh. So, uh, she can't really tell us a lot about it, but what can you tell us about the movie that you're starring in? Oh, I'm not starring in it. I mean, I was, well, this is where, you know, stay humble, guys. I am not starring in it, okay? Um, I have the pleasure mm -hmm. of being in a movie that is starring Starring Queen Latifah, Dolly Parton, uh, Kiki Palmer's in there, um, Kirk Franklin. Um, it's it is a it's going to be released in 2012, so stay tuned for that. But it's again, it's just another really positive movie. Mm -hmm. um, we're singing, we're dancing. Like I I still can't believe that I'm like getting to stand next to and sing next to Dolly Parton herself right, right. and and the Queen herself right. and. Um, but, you know, I can say the cast is really great, the crew, I just, I feel very fortunate to be a part of, um, the, this movie and, and a movie that has a good message. So, um, it's called Joyful Noise mm -hmm. and you can check it out, I guess, in 2012. I'll let you know when it comes out yeah. for sure. Okay. Um, now what was it like to get that call? Because people dream about, you know, being in movies or whatever, and I think it's kind of cool that you are so multi-talented that, you know, you have everything going on in the music area moving forward. And then you get a call to say, <laughs> you're going to be in the movie with Dolly Parton and Queen Latifah. Like, what was your response to that? Um, it was, I was shocked, I'll be honest, mm -hmm. because the audition fell into my lap. Mm -hmm. It just, you know, it was one of those things that, like, you know, if it's for me, God, let it be for right. me. But right. but I, I didn't really have any expectations of, of getting it. Mm -hmm. um, and when they called me, I was at the dinner table with my family. And it's like, you want to play it cool because right. you're on the phone. I'm like, oh, oh, okay. But inside, I'm like, ah! <laughs> As soon as I hung up, my family. Yeah. Uh, it was it was a surprise. Mm -hmm. It was a shock. Um, I can't I can't say that it was me. Like I just I feel very blessed. Um, very very. Blessed. But I believe God blesses people who try. Yeah. You know I really do believe yeah. that. You know it's it's I think it's half favor. You know mm -hmm. whole grace. But what when you really 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 try, like promise is always working. That's one thing I can say about her. She's my friend, so I know. She's always in the studio, always writing, always doing something. She always has a meeting or she always has, you know, she's just always working. Yeah. And if you really want something, that's yeah. what you have to do. Mm -hmm. So just really excited about everything that's going on with her, not only the movie, but the Pinky Project that we spoke about earlier. You actually have a show coming up. Yes. Tell us a little bit about that. It is going to be Tuesday, February 1st. Um, it's at Inferno Lounge here in Atlanta. Mm -hmm. um, the address is 393 Marietta Street. Um, it's going to be my project release party, my Yay. website launch party, but it's also the um, I Keep It Classic showcase. So you'll get to see my full show, but you'll also get to see a lot of up-and-coming artists, a lot of great talent in Atlanta. Um, Get there at 9, show starts at 10, and it's just a good, you know, it's not just for artists, it's a networking experience, right, right. it's, you know, 
what entertainment photographers bloggers like mm -hmm. whatever um aspect of entertainment that you're in go and network you don't know who you'll meet exactly um, yeah. you guys know about keep it classic i've blogged it before it's just an incredible movement that's happening here in atlanta yeah. unfortunately my worldwide baby cake uk canada if you guys come to atlanta you can come to the show. You too. You too. <laughs> but love, yeah. thank God for YouTube. Thank God for vlogs and all of that yeah. because you'll see all of the, you know, things you'll that, see me. <laughs> that Promise has going on via the web. Yeah. So, um, want to thank Promise for coming by and chatting it up with the girl Anytime. for a minute. Um, thanks to Coffee Loft, um, Alex in the Coffee Loft 322 Peter Street for letting us crash his place. To come check for a minute. <laughs> All right. Well, I love you guys. Come mm -hmm. to the website. Yes. Um, you can find me on Twitter. Mm -hmm. Follow me. It is Promise Music. Mm -hmm. My website is promiseis.com. P-R-O-M-I-S-E-I-S.com. You can download the Pinky Project. Um, you can, it has my links to YouTube and all that. So please, please visit the website. I worked hard on it. I, she did. Um, I'm very proud of it. And, it's you know, so follow cute. me. And, and it's so cute. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> <laughs> that was the whole goal. Um, but follow me. You can, uh, I'll keep you posted on the show and things like that. So, and thank you, Kiki, for having me. I appreciate it. Follow this girl. Nothing. Now, if you guys want to contact Promise or book Promise, who yes. should they? Um, you can contact my manager. Shout outs to KG. Shout out to KG. Hey, uh, <laughs> for booking, <What> up? <laughs> you can reach him at 404-425-8963. Um, if you go to the website, promiseis.com, uh, it's also got his email address and contact information there as well. Yes. All right, well, love you guys, and see you next time. Okay,